An internet speed test estimates how fast your connection can transfer data by uploading and downloading test information. The speed it calculates varies depending on how long your device takes to send and receive this material. However, several factors can affect the accuracy of these tests. Tests don't guarantee consistent speeds at all times because so many real-world factors affect the test, including the number of connected devices, computer, or equipment speed and server load. You'll likely see a slowdown if you're using a shared connection or if you're testing during times of peak network traffic. There are, though, a few things you can do for more accurate tests. First, close other open browser windows and applications that are running. More active operations means more bandwidth consumed and thus more network congestion is created, which can lead to slower speeds. For example, antivirus software could be downloading an update in the background and causing the test to underestimate your speed. Before testing, restart your computer and router to refresh the connection and clear the cache memory. Be aware of other connected devices, tablets, video game systems, smartphones, laptops, and smart home appliances also transmit data. They could reduce the amount of bandwidth available to the device you're testing and make it run more slowly. Wired connections generally provide faster speeds than shared Wi-Fi signals. If you do test over Wi-Fi, be aware that some electronics and microwave ovens can interfere with the wireless communications resulting in slower upload or download speeds. The distance between your device and the router also has a major impact. Defective or outdated equipment frequently slows down internet access. Computers, modems, and Wi-Fi routers can all contribute to this problem. Finally, keep in mind that internet speed tests don't provide exact results. The numbers differ depending on the programming techniques used by the speed test developer. For more information, call, click, or visit Arvig.